Today is something different. Today is a full day of eating, guys. I have not done this in a while, so bear with me because I'm gonna take you guys through full day of eating on an active recovery day. First things first is my morning routine of drinking a whole lot of water, apple cider vinegar, greens, all of that. And then breakfast, I haven't fully decided on it. I'm thinking an egg scramble with bacon this morning. It's an active recovery day, so I do get a little bit more fat today. 90 grams of fat. Yes, you guys heard that right. Egg scramble and maybe some oatmeal. I think that's what else on the menu. Let's get started. Let's get down to business. What am I actually making for breakfast this morning? Usually I eat the same thing on my training days. Um, try to keep it consistent unless I'm getting tired of eggs. You all know I'll do my famous eggs and oatmeal recipe. I'll have to share that in another YouTube video, but today I'm not doing that. And then on recovery rest days, I do spend a little bit more time with what I'm about to eat just because I have more free time and I do eat a little bit higher fat on these days. So spend time making some bacon this morning, Icelandic bacon guys. And then gonna do eggs. That's how they look here in Iceland, not any different. And then I'm gonna do mushrooms and I have some onions cut up somewhere. And then I'm gonna do oatmeal. Honestly, you guys, this is how everything looks at the store. It's in Icelandic and I'm just like looking at pictures hoping I pick the right item. Yeah, so I'm gonna do a mushroom onion bacon scramble with oatmeal on the side, and I'll show you guys a little bit what I like to add to top it off that makes it feel like dessert. Gosh, vlogging you guys is so difficult. <laughs> trying to set up the camera angle, making sure you can see my food, all of it. I'm trying my best here. But anyways, egg frittata. I love making something like this because it is so easy to do. You just throw your veggies in, throw whatever ingredients you want inside of the frittata, and then you just cover it on low, and then it comes out like a beautiful frittata. Mine kind of broke when I brought it out of the pan, so it's not super pretty, but if you're ever wondering how to do something different than scrambled eggs over easy. I love doing something like this. And then my oatmeal. I don't know, I just love adding a little bit of heavy cream on top. Like it feels like growing up, I loved whipped cream. And so now adding this little bit of heavy cream, a little bit of maple syrup, some cinnamon, it tastes like dessert, you guys. And then of course, Hot sauce is life. Anyone else comment down below who does hot sauce with almost everything. I'm a big hot sauce fan with eggs. All right, let's see how this goes. So good. What's on the agenda for today? It is about nine o'clock or so. I slept in today because today is rest day and then we are gonna go to the gym at 12 to do a little bit of active recovery and a little bit of kin stretching. It's a different type of stretching, but you guys will get to see just a little snippet of that. And then I need to go pick up a package today. Need to go do some other like visa things here in Iceland that we need. And basically just kind of resting and relaxing, stretching, recovery. Gonna do a little bit of work on Grown Strong. All right, just got done with our active recovery session. We did about 32 minutes on the bike with some 10 second sprints mixed in. And then everyone else stretched for about 45 minutes while I went and got some body work done. And then I went and picked up food from one of my go-to places here in Iceland when I'm just looking for something quick and easy. It's called Glow. I'll show you guys what I got, but it's just a bowl. Chicken, brown rice, sweet potato, broccoli, beets, hummus, all the good stuff. Just wanted to quickly talk with you all about my eating during the CrossFit Games Open. Really does not change at all. You all think maybe there might be a secret that depending where I'm at in the season, I might be eating a little bit differently. But honestly, I think one thing for me, I do love to treat myself a little bit on rest day recovery days where I don't spend time or don't have to like make my meals, which is crazy. Just during the week, I usually meal prep during training. So I just have some chicken in the fridge or rice or like already cooked broccoli or something. So I can just throw together a meal. But then I get tired of it. And like by the time I get to a rest day, I'm like, I just want to eat someone else's food, which is why I love to like treat myself maybe to like the acai place or a bowl like this or 
a sandwich from Joe and the Juice. Oh, it just tastes so good when you eat someone else's food, right? Just came into my apartment and threw down my jacket on the couch. Quickly made this meal because you guys, I am hangry. And right now I'm having white fish that I made last night. I seasoned it with garlic powder, a little bit of Italian seasoning, olive oil, salt, and pepper, and then I threw it into the oven. I don't even know how long I cooked it in the oven, and I'm so confused with the Celsius to Fahrenheit conversion that I just got lucky that it cooked just right. And then I had white rice I made the other day, threw an avocado on it, and then I love topping one of my meals of the day with some sort of sprouts, which are really great for you, detoxing and really underrated vegetable that no one ever eats. So next time you are in the grocery store, look for sprouts or alfalfa sprouts, microgreens. I absolutely love them. And then I topped it off with a little bit of hot sauce. And now I'm about to eat, clean the place a little bit, and then I picked up an exciting package that apparently has been sitting at the FedEx office since February 11th, but I had no idea, and I'm kind of irritated, you guys. But it is what it is, today's a good day. It is 5 p.m. eating my third meal of the day. Okay, you guys, I came home to the best package, or just opened the best package. Been running low on supplements out here in Iceland, and Never wanna risk it with things I don't know or have no idea about. So I'm just so grateful to have Momentus, my sponsor, ship out much needed supplements that I need, including my favorite collagen, protein recovery, yeah. collagen, hydrate, central protein, recovery. I'm excited to try this new collagen shot, PR lotion, and then elite sleep. I'm gonna be sleeping like a baby. Moment of truth. This is a new product that I have not tried yet. Momentus just came out with about a few weeks ago and I always add their plain collagen into my water in the morning, but now I get to try their collagen shot. So let's see, not sure if that's focusing. <laughs> All right, use two shots 30 before exercise to increase natural collagen synthesis or one daily collagen. All right, here we go. Did not open it properly, but so easy to take and it tastes good too. I hate when things like don't taste good and you're just like making a face after. All right, you guys, I wanted to go like this and it went like this. I don't even know what I was doing. I'm impressed and super excited about this because sometimes it's difficult, you know, to carry this like big powder into the gym. So sometimes you just want something easy that you can just throw in your gym bag. So I think this product is really great and I'm so excited about this because I travel a bunch and it's just easy to carry in my bags when I'm traveling. All right, 6.40, not hungry yet. On rest days, I just, you know, I just don't really feel that hungry. So we'll see if maybe I get a little bit hungrier in a little bit and I'm gonna eat what well, I need to eat because I'm behind on my macros. So we'll see guys. But anyways, nothing exciting happening on my end. I think I'm gonna go for a little stretch right now. Still eating on this long day of eating. No, I just clean my place right now, lit some candy, getting ready for the open announcement and right now I'm not feeling like normal food like I don't feel like eating ground beef or anything I had a really great meal with fish earlier probably could have had another serving of veggies but you know what today's just not one of those days so I'm gonna finish off with a yogurt snack that is what I'm craving right now the Icelandic skier yogurt some berries almond butter and granola you can never go wrong with this snack and then maybe I'll have one more thing later Bon appetit. Closing out full day of eating with some popcorn. Honestly, you guys, I'm so excited, but kind of scared to do this with Annie. She texted me. So 22.2 deadlifts and burpees. And we both, whenever we do a deadlift workout, we end up killing each other. What she texts me, she's like, hot damn. Don't know if I want to do this with you. Well, I was like, I'm scared for both of us. And Kat's gonna be so fast on the burpees, but gonna hit the workout tomorrow. Gonna feel so fueled because I ate a whole lot of good food today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, make sure you give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe so you never miss a video of mine. And let me know what you wanna see more of in the comments down below. Forgot to mention that today's Calorie intake was 2,800 calories on a recovery day. So pretty much almost 3,000 calories and I didn't even train today. Girls, not afraid to eat, not afraid of carbs. Make sure you fuel yourself and I promise you, you're gonna feel so much better when you actually fuel yourself with a whole lot of good quality food. All right, <laughs> bye everyone. Mm -hmm.